baptism of the Holy Ghost build the capacity of the life. Are you with me? Uh, are you still here? Salvation give you this life. Baptism in water activate this life. Are you still with me? But the baptism of the Holy Ghost build the capacity of that life inside you. You are the one that will now know the capacity you are and that will determine the capacity of how you talk. Are you still with me now? And that's why you must move from one level to what another. If you are born again, we thank God for you. But if you are born again, you are not baptized in water. We want to tell you, go and baptize in water. And if you are born again, you are baptized in water. Want, you have not received the baptism of the Holy Ghost. We want to encourage you. Receive the word, the baptism of the Holy Ghost. It makes you to be in charge and makes the capacity of this life in you to be bigger for you to be able to achieve the purpose of God for your life. So the next one, letter R. This life raised us up to sit with Christ far above what? Principalities and power. You can see that in the book of Ephesians 2. Ephesians 2 verse 5 to 6. It says we are seated in Christ. If you now go to Ephesians 1 verse 18, you now say far above what? Principalities and power. Say I am above. Hey, so that I now. Please talk now. Principalities. And power. Let you need a buffet bear, my bear, why, Jemma? The challenge is that I mean, only while I am all. Pray up, eh? Are you still here? Pray up, point you what in channel what to believe the power of the enemy more than the power of God. Emma, what Emma G mindset what could shift to that they exist yes exist so so we understand but we must not be so much conscious of them. We must be conscious of who we are. Now, we are seated far, 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 far. Even when I want to do in level you, do you, oh, I'm not going into this teaching. Are you with me? If you look at the categories of the dark world, I want to to show their servants. Are you with me? Now, the first categories is the categories of the principalities. The next, power, spiritual wickedness. These are the four major that will, Scripture told us in Ephesians 6. Are you still with me? Now, our principalities is share one in one control community, one control nation. Are you with me? Toba de lu mi, toba lagbara, ti resurrected life will be strong, toba muti tele ole debe kuma muti. Ako yele nuko te si shibi kan pa, le yi shibi kan mi. Shibi... Are you with me? The principalities to one bear, principalities or team. The bad day me, you me, principalities are shallow. Are you with me? But that's not my topic for today. That's why God now gave you the ability to sit in Him far above them. So that's why the Bible says He has given you power to tread upon scorpion and serpent and all the power of the I love this one. The Bible says, even though you not do mistake, you will understand mistake. Dream poison. It shall by no means. Oh, I'm a resurrected like me. Whatever dead come in contact with resurrected life, it become alive. Whatever that is dead, the resurrected life I come in contact with, it become alive in any two way. And that's why that's why that's the work of a light. If darkness come into light, it will become light. If lights come into darkness, it will work. It become light. That's no two way about it. So you must come to understand that what resurrected light entails is that it makes you to what to rise up and sit with Christ far above principalities and power. The next hour, I love it so much. Reign, reigning as what as king and priest in our area. Resurrected life makes you operate as a king and as a priest. So you have to listen attentively to this. 
There is a dimension that God created us to be. I called it a two-legged dimension. Say, I have the king leg. I have the priest leg. Eh, so that that now. Hello, me, you know, I'm here, second loan. Are you with me? As a king, you have a throne. As a priest, you have an altar. The potency of the altar will determine the power of the throne. Are you still with me? The potency of what? Ah, uh, youth fellowship. The potency of what? We determine the world. How many of us want to raise the dead? How many of us want to cast out demons? How many of us want to do great signs and wonders? Even a quote no what? Mo, for you, mother. Kilo, ah, youth fellowship. How many of us want to raise the dead? How many of us want to do great signs and wonders? Like Apostle Paul. Are you with me? How many of you want to write books that will last generation to generation to generation? Hey, how many of you want to have money in billions to support evangelism? Ah! Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem. Ministry to you, yeah, no problem. Yeah, no problem. Everybody have their own ministry. No problem. But whatever capacity you want, you want to have many money to support evangelism, you want to be the one to go out to do the work, in whatever capacity you want to do the, you must function as a king and you must function as a priest. That was the mind of God. If you go and study the book of Exodus, Exodus, I think Exodus 19, when it came out of Egypt, God was saying, I want to make my people the kingdom of priests. Now, Apostle Peter make us to understand that you are a chosen generation, a royal war. Now, if you now study in the book of Revelation 1, verse 5 and 6, Revelation 5, 5, 5 and verse 10, he told us that Jesus made us to be king and what? Priest. That means the mind of God is that God wants you to function in your kingship capacity and God wants you to function in your priesthood capacity. As a priest, you are to be a major intercessor. Anywhere you are, God has placed you there to cause a change, to intercede for people. And also, if the devil is now coming, like a flood. As a king there, you are the one to enforce a standard against it. Are you still with me? Now, that's why God has given you your mouth to be able to function in the place of intercession. Why be alone? Why be alone? So why intercede? But when it comes to the place of the enemy, oh, ni be enemy. Why mu kingship character lo majade? But about a lot of baba, oh, the so called kingship character no lo ba ngoba o. Why function as the priest? Why be be ko lu ala no lori? But by time to mama be do do issue. Kun she be. Why do be lion? You make a decree. And that's why the Bible says, decree 18. And it shall or Baloman decree. The Bible says, where the word of a king is, there is what? Say, I have power. Youth fellowship. Ah, ah. Ah, ah, well, don't say, I have power. Say, greater is he that is in me. That he that is in the world. Say, I am born of God. I have the life of God. These are the confessions that make the devil tremble. Hey, she will like it. Could like it at all. If you always tell yourself who you are and you confess it at all times, the devil will tremble. The devil will tremble. I see the devil falling over your destiny in the name of Jesus. Quickly, letter E, antenna in nature. This resurrected life is internal in nature. Boshe bere, o continue ayi ra yin. Even tobacco la ye yi. This resurrected life is internal in nature. And the Bible let us to understand. We go and study the book of First John five, First John five verse eleven to twelve. The Bible say, whosoever have Christ have this life, because this life is internal. One of the major things about resurrected life is a life that is internal, and is a life that cannot be corrupt. Corruption only war. Corruption only war. Now, it's a life that can swallow sickness. Are you with me? It's a life that can swallow death. Are you still with me? It's a life. So it is internal. Say, I have internal life. I have internal life. I'm almost true. Say, say, I have internal life. You know what this internal life is? We call it Zoe. 
Eh? It's called what? Way. It's the life of God. That's why Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the what? And the life. It's internal. You are not ending on this earth. By the time I change the address, Tabawa lord of Babati Barrier to read me. Ah, ah. Emma Mokwan Kong. I'm a senior Kong in Ha. Hey. 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 And what we'll do is that we'll celebrate the King of Kings and we'll rejoice with him and worship him forever. Let us see. This resurrected life carries the presence of God everywhere. It carries the what? The presence of God anywhere. Matthew 28 verse 20. Matthew 28 verse 20. Jesus said, I will be with you even to the end of the world. Let us see. Resurrected life takes over territory for God. It's a life that what? Takes over the what? Territories for God. Let me quickly, because I want to go to the what it entails. You can see that in the book of Joshua 1 verse 3. Bible says, anywhere the sole of your feet shall stay. Bible says the word, I will possess it. Letter E. Letter E. Letter E. To choose. Let me choose envelope by favor. Is a resurrected life is a life that is enveloped by favor and mercy. If you are conscious of this life, you carry favor at all times. One or later, one or later, reject it. Could they be consequent in content? Ah, activate here now. Are you with me? I call only cut you. Ah, are you with me? Only I want it to get to buy on Babawa. Only I want Sam. Are you with me? Only I want to come up with our bat. Toba, Tet, Tet, you know me. Kinney commercially. Activate it, pardon me. Why? Because they have the embodiment of what? Of favor. It's a life that is enveloped by favor. Even when the king saw Esther, the king cannot resist her. Why? Because favor was all around Esther. And the last one, letter D. Letter D. A resurrected life is a life that is dedicated to God's service. It's a life that the moment you see someone that is conscious of this resurrected life, you will see that they are dedicated to service. I want you to pray church. Can you go to church? I want to pray to church. Are you with me? That's the kind of life. They are conscious of it. I want you to pray to church. Come at the phone anyhow. Resurrected life, dedicated to service. One only one, one only one church come can use. Mm. They are dedicated to worship, and they are dedicated to all to the service of all of Jehovah. Say, I am dedicated. Oh, so that don't you ring? So sure, sir. Oh, sure, we are dedicated. Oh, sure, we are dedicated. Well, do I like me? So we should be dedicated to talk. Kill answer to phone. Show gang ya, show gang. And it's all about gang. What you make ya? I want to have one. I just come back from all I want to have one. Are you with me? Say I am dedicated to the service of God. So we let you know, Lord. We need let you wash us. Shall we go to God dancing? Shall we go to God dance? Eh, you go to God dance. Ah. And you're coming in more with that, and you're coming in more with that. Are you with me? It is important to know that this resurrected life is always drawn to God, because the source is God, and because the source is God, He always drawn to God. Now this will take us to the resurrected life. I can't finish it, but I want to stay on one or two, which is major for me, and I want you to follow with the whole of your heart. Let's go to the next one. Make up of this resurrected life. If you are blessed, say amen. amen. If you are blessed, say amen. amen. Now, let me just give you a little background about this makeup. I'll be using the text of Revelation. Revelation 1, 13 to 17. Go and study it at home. That's the text we'll be using for this makeup. Now, 
Don't forget I said I was alive before. If you are still here, say amen. Yeah. Uh -huh. I just want everybody to follow. Don't forget we said I was alive before. Adam was a living world. So, you understand? Now, Please follow. Adam 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 the first thing to notice nipa ye won on it is i want shake ni they were naked e pa tawo fun gan don't forget i said jesus is the resurrection and the life do you remember that now can we travel to revelation and see the picture of jesus in his resurrected form do you know that why Jesus was on earth? Jesus was doing signs and wonders. John read Jesus. But Jesus was like, Oh, could you? Eh, oh, you have to do John, mama, we quickly don't share it. You know, 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 won ba Jesu mi fun 3 and a half years won ri pe eyan ni sugbon won mo make up resurrected life yi now ni igba ti john wa ri jesu hmm eh ya 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 eni to ba jeun to ba soro fun 3 and a half years ni igba to ri jesus ni the resurrected life o ba o ko se ni to ri jesus ti wa ko duro o to be o to be are you with me? Need but only Jesus. Oh, bow! Because only dimension of the resurrected life. These are the things in the Revelation where you can go and study. They are power. But I want to just share one major one of it. So let's travel to the Revelation. Let's go to Revelation 1. Revelation 1. Now, let's go to verse, verse 13. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks. One like unto the Son of Man, uh -huh. clothed with a garment down to the foot. God bless you. That's the first one I want to use. Probably that's what we'll study today. What was the first thing they said about the Son of Man? Edamelona. What was the first thing Adam noticed that he missed? The clothes. So what was the first thing to us on it this? Jesus in sin. That means only in Concordia Damason. There is a garment called the garment of glory. See a shekba. Low Adam. Garment of glory. A shek jagba low way. I see with me. Because of that glory, he was unable to carry the presence of God in full capacity. Ki Adam to shek. That's why it's been more at that time. Are you still with me? Ti lion ba ri Adam ko to be lati gi Adam je in that state. Ti Adam ba ro nu po n fe lo sumi ninu odo. Ti kokodai ba wa nbe, kokodai o le gbe je. O ma ijo sere ni. In fact mo ro be a mosquito man je ngba no. Are you still with me ko? Mo so pe mo ro be. Ki la sa ti so nje. Eh, hey, Damilo, kill us at the Asian jet. It means more on Lobe and Yamaka. I'm going to watch a science student. No, we shall have a mosquito now. I leave more mobile on Shishin, but in one way or the other, more mosquito legend. But what am I saying? The cloth of that glory was so powerful. So, a shed ballo. And the moment he was responding to God, the first thing he said, I heard your voice. I was afraid because. I was naked. Are you still with me now? Now, when this resurrected life, they are not telling us about the resurrected life. The first thing they told us about this resurrected life was that resurrected life was sitting among the church. You can go and study Revelation way. That's why, why did they say Jesus was among the center of the church? Because Jesus must be in the center of everything you do in life. And when you are preaching, Jesus must be in the center. In your office, Jesus must be in the center. As a banker, Jesus must be in the center. You are doing Uber, Jesus must be what? The center. That's why Jesus is in the center 
of the church. But the first look about him was his what? His garment. And that garment is full of glory. Now, let's not take it down. But Joseph, OP, fear, Lati so ashwara no. Lati maintain ashwara me. Are you with me? Bibel is okay, oh so ashwara nye no. Fun ya o potifa, oh maintain ashwara me. Oh yi be o go, and that's what the Bible says, even in the prison, God was with. Because so garment yen. She kon she hauzon. To fe fe ga kampala. Show you white. Hey, can I have Ecclesiastes? Ecclesiastes 9, verse 8. Oh my God. Ecclesiastes 9, verse 8. Bible said, let your garment be what? Let your garment be always white. Now, look at it. Look at it. Let your garment be always. Tell your neighbor, let your garment. Ah, eh, so that it's in Bino. Ah, it's in Bino, dear, dear. Be always white. I will tell you five things about white. If you know these five things about white, garment will not stay. Upon the garment and me, what is stay? Oppo, garment it only want to bo. Emo this is don't have to bo garment tell me. Oh, if you go back to that Revelation one, ni ba to so le pa garment Jesus wants to only guard you about so be. And girt about the paths with one wash with me. Gadu. Are you with me? Or one wash with me too, Nigadu. Tigadu Bawa Lare, one needed a wash with me. My Jomon Kegubu told two of them I will guard you more. Are you with me? My tell a doctor, we won't wash our drum or guard you. Even Jesus has a garment and he has a guard. Are you with me? That garment is the truth. If you go to efficiencies, he was telling us about your word. The belt of war. Tio Tito Bawa Lenu and Nibo Boba. I show go for Talati Rashu Ebo. Bigabi she one see. Tiba so called Le Tobafe for Bo Anira. Tio Tito Bawa Lenu and Nibo Boba. I show go for Talati Bashu Emir. Are you still with me? What are the five things about whites? So I can shut it down here. Don't forget, it's a three month course. Are you with me? So. As many lecturers will be coming, they will be bringing their own dimensions, and at the end of this three months, we will all be blessed in Jesus' name. I will stop in the dimension of the garment. Five things that will always make your garment to be white. I love using acronyms, so can we start again? The first one is letter W. Ways must be perfect and right in God's presence. Your ways must be what? And what? If you go and study Second Chronicles 25 verse 2, there was a king called Amaziah. He served the Lord, but not with a perfect... That was a stain. He was serving God. But was it a perfect heart? The question is, are you serving God with a perfect heart? Are you sincere and genuine? Shekho Shai served his loving she. Carry me. Ki shepherd diri me. You may be serving God, but your service must be perfect. And do you know, while we are in the Bible study, I told them something that is very powerful. Things can be holy and still not be acceptable. Are you still with me? It can be holy and still not what? We can see you that you are holy, holy brother. But as far as God is concerned, he's not accepting you. Are you still with me now? So that's why it must be perfect. The first things about your clothes, that always ask yourself this question. Is it with a perfect heart? Number two. Oh my God. 
letter H. Honesty. Honesty in dealing with men. In what? Be a shwe she le fufu ni yao. Ni li ayeto wa yi wa dik pe la wen yon. Do you know scripture told us in the book of Romans? Romans 12 verse 17. Go and study it. Romans 12 verse 17. He told us. Can we have it on the screen? Romans 12 verse 17. Romans 12 verse 17. Oh, quiet. You can read it for me. Recompense to no man uh -huh. evil for evil. Uh -huh. Provide things honest in the sight of all men. Provide things honest in how many sight? In the sight of all men. How many men? That's what will make your garment to always be white. You must be honest in providing things in the sight of what? All men. Next one, letter I. Ah. Integrity in words must be top notch. Your in integrity in your words or when uh, must what? Let your yes be yes. Let your no be what? No. Bible says any other thing that come in from it comes from the evil one. That one is powerful. Bible says you shall be judged by the word of your word. These are powerful things, oh. Oh, no Bible. Oh, God, come in the Bible. That's why the only Bible is the Bible says you shall be judged by the word of your mouth. Your ways must be perfect. You must be honest in dealing with men. The word of your mouth must be with high integrity. Letter T. Total obedience to God's instructions. Total obedience to God's instruction. On toba ni koshe, on ni koshe. Ma fikun, ma yokuru. Obey God in whatever you are doing. Ancient is perfect. And I stop with this. Letter E. Engage love work and faith work. Engage what? Love work and faith. Beg be a yefe. Beg be a ye babo. Bible said without faith. No one can please God. Bible says love covers the multitude of all of sin. And to bang big be a ye fe oh my difficult to stay. That's why the Bible says the all the commandments, both of the prophets and of the law, is encamped in two. Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your mind, and with all your soul. And love your neighbor. Say, I receive capacity to love. I saw that down now. Say it better again. Even to love my enemy, but not covenanted enemy. Let me explain that. There are two types of enemy. Enemy, Shoshi, I already know Jamie, let's say, no problem. I love you, you know. I say with me. But when enemy, they have been covenanted to do evil. Are you with me? They are the agent of the principalities and power. Are you with me? Jesus told us in the book of Luke, he said, where are those enemies that will not allow me to reign? Say, bring them and let's slaughter them from the mouth of Jesus. Are you with me? Those ones, we deal with them. We deal with them. But this one, we feed ourselves and we continue. Exactly. So I receive grace. To love. love. I will stop here today. By God's grace, do a study of Revelation 1 and you will learn more. So it's time for question. So if you have question, please let's have it. How can we be baptized of the Holy Ghost? How can you be baptized of the Holy Ghost? Now, quickly let me tell us. Are we see here? Now, the question this person is bringing for is that, how can we be baptized of the Holy Ghost? Now, I told us that salvation will make you have the life. Baptism of water will activate it. And you build up the more of the capacity by the baptism of the Holy Ghost. Now, when Jesus resurrected, you know that Jesus came to them in John 20, he said, receive the what? The Holy Spirit. And the Bible says, and the bread to them. That was when they became born again. Because they can't be born again while Jesus was on an earth. 
Are you still with me? So when he breathed unto them, they received the fullness of the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit came upon them and they started living in them. They became born again. But at that time, they have not received the baptism of the Holy Spirit. So Jesus told them that they should wait until the, what? the power comes upon them. So in Acts 2, what happened? When they were waiting, the moment happened, there was a rushing mighty wind and it fell upon them. And when it fell upon them, it was like a clove of fire. And scripture said they spoke in war in tongues. So to be baptized of the Holy Ghost, number one, what scripture tells us about baptism of the Holy Ghost is that you can meet somebody that have the baptism of the Holy Ghost, they can lay hands on you and you also be, all, be baptized. You can be in the congregation and you listen just as Apostle Peter was preaching to the house of Colinus, as, as he was preaching because they were attentive. What happened? The Holy Spirit came upon them and they were baptized of the Holy Ghost. It could be by laying of hands and it could be by under the influence of the power of the Holy Ghost when you are listening and you are attentive and you are for it. I received the baptism of the Holy Ghost in this church. And I know it's original. It's not fake. There are many fake ones. Are you still with me? So just ensure you are rightly connected, you receive the original one, and the Lord will bless us in Jesus' name. Hope I was able to answer that. Ah, this question. How can we be speaking in tongues? I love speaking in tongues. The Lord is good. Okay. Now, listen, listen. I want to believe this is a, is a major topic, but listen attentively with all sincerity with the one I will go and, and report to at the end of days. It's important we speak in tongues. God gave us their capacity as our language. That you did not speak in tongues does not mean you will go to hell. It's not a criteria to go to heaven. Are you still with me? Am I balancing it now? So don't let anybody intimidate you. But is it good? It's good. I may not be able to do a teaching of the fool now. But if you want... As I told you, I received it in this church. Let me just give you my simple story. While we are growing up in the church, there are some brothers that they believe in it. Why? Because most times we don't talk about it. I caught the fire. I said I wanted it. I was praying. I was praying. We went for a retreat. And why in the retreat? Because that was my heart desire. I said, God, I, received, I need the baptism of Holy Ghost with the evidence of speaking in tongues. And in that retreat, I received it. And when I received my own, it was not in the longer way. It's just like one or two words. I believe it. I just believe it's original. Because anything you do with God must be by faith. Are you with me? In this kingdom, if you want to please God, the Bible says those that must come to him must know that he is. And he's a rewarder of those that diligently work. So God is a rewarder of diligent seeker. But he doesn't cast away ordinary seeker. Are you with me? So by faith you'll be... So I received it. I believe it. When I started... I started speaking it one by one. I, I just know, I, so I don't know what I'm saying. But I was just by faith. I stay it because I know I didn't go to learn it. Because I didn't go to somebody, uh, no. I just know I have the original. And what happened, it was in this youth fellowship. I was just called one day and they asked me, go there, there is somebody that is possessed, go and cast out demon. I said, Brother Femi. I just went. Brother Femi, enter. In your court, you are possessed. Is it that life or death? I see with me. These are going in the place is war. Is war. I know what I'm saying. Ah, I just started, Father, in Jesus' name, in Jesus' name. And the truth of the matter, with all sincerity, what I didn't value so much just came out. Pa, 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 pa. And what happened? The demon went out. Hey, I said I have the original. Are you with me? Are you with me? Because it will only take a light. To shade away what darkness. So what you have to do is that ensure that you believe it. God will give it to you. Don't go and learn it. And you must also follow. There are some principles about it, about the church. All what you have to do is that it's important for you. I think I can't go more than that. 
How can you be one of a sinner and the gifts never leave him or her? Is it the spirit giving him the opportunity to change or what? I didn't understand. How can one be a sinner and the gifts never leave him or her? Is it the spirit that gives them the opportunity to change or what? I think what this person is saying is that Elisha, Tony, Tony gifts, maybe own only gift of it for Ejama Pagotonga, Sheka Sotofonga. I won't look one fit for Shogomi. So it's not ultimate. In fact, in the kingdom, when we talk about, I'm not playing down speaking in tongues, but what the Bible talked about speaking in tongues is that it shall be a sign for the what? For the unbeliever. That's the start for. But only J. Imagine, I want to balance it. Bible says, out of your foot, we shall what? We shall know them. Now, any to je eleshe, to ba jekwe eleshe ni, that means he's not born again. Ah, I'm going to use my verse for But that is all the Bible. Say, I am a saint. Say I'm a saint. I am a saint. Now, some people will say, ah, oh, she's a saint, you to parallel. But that's the Bible. Apostle Paul was writing to the Corinthians. He said, I write to the saints. Apostle Paul was writing to the Romans. I write to the saints. Apostle Paul was writing all, virtually all the book Apostle Paul wrote. He said, I wrote to the saints. Why? Because they had the internal life. So he called them the saints. As far as God is concerned, they have moved from being a sinner to a what? To a saint. So if that person is a sinner, I want to believe he's not born again. Are you still with me now? Now, if he's not born again, whatever gift is manifesting, I won't say it's category from God. But if it is a sinner in our own understanding, are you still with me? If a sinner in our own understanding, if I hear from Jesus, 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 the only reason to let you discuss the enemy if your spirit did not accept it. And that's why the Bible says your spirit will bear witness with your spirit. He can say something that is genuine and you go against it. Why Jack Baffin? Are you still with me now? Hello, me there's a question on the low way. Only low way, friend. He told you what he jumped or talked, born or latter joy, what he bears so, or be baba, oh, bo, or baba so, oh, bo, or batishago. What the only way that if you go on in Nokuno, you sorrow, only can wear a basso. What I call here, my change, to baba or latter, all I call law and yep, unnecessary. He told you, no longer, but if you get a cat, a baba lamuso, what in basso teleco, bo, or I pay little mamu sense, you was so here, kick at even cat a cat a co, bono. The case the balamine, another special case in it. I see with me now. So, God can use those things, but not all the time. You must come to be a balanced Christian that live in the center of the road. The first way God wants to speak to you is personal. God wants to speak to you in a... The best way to hear from God is what is called inner witness. That's everybody learning here. Just listening to your inner witness. If your conscience is right, you will begin to get direction from it. Hope I balance that question. And the last question here. As a resurrected being, how do I love in peace with all men in this perverse world we have? How do we live? Okay. How do we live in peace? Ah. The truth of the matter is that people is okay. Are you with me? But can I tell you something? Write this major prayer point. God gave us yesterday while we are praying. Okay, we'll pray it today. Grace that preserve. Say grace that preserve. Oh, they saw that out. The truth of the matter is that corruption is in your logo. And one of the major ways the corruption in generation is because of destruction. Many of us are too distracted. And because we are distracted, we can't focus on the major. Are you still with me now? If I do a survey of this, many of us now, and we spend the, we do a chart of the time we spend on Facebook, 
the time we play on all, all those things, TikTok and everything. And the time we spend on the Word of God, you will discover that the time you spend on social media is like 40% or 50% of the day. That means, Toba there discover me, I'm going to you, I just so tough, you know. Are you still with me? Toba will Facebook to the extent we will be my friend back home. You're made a lot of sherry. Hey, damn it. Do you know why? If you look at those things so much, there is an energy consciously or unconsciously to my take out. After that energy is taken out, you may not be able to do what is necessary. Now, let me now give you another sample. To draw in the presence of God in the place of worship. What is called energy? Now, compare me age. Or draw it become energy law. Or don't become energy poor. Now, perversion will come in this world because on Josie be energy in Oh, King Josie be energy. So, how will you live in this perverse world? Stay in the secret place. Somebody says, say, say in the secret place. Maybe another time we'll be able to talk about the secret place because secret place is a powerful place. It's a place you must stay day and night. I'm trusting that the Lord will give us strength, energy, to live in this perverse world in Jesus' name. Let's jam our hands together for the Lord. We want to bless the Lord for a blessed session this morning. The resurrected life which is our team for the second quarter of the year, has been well decomposed by the lecturer. And I think the, it has brought to us the importance of a renew, the renewal of our mind, the meaning of following a resurrected life, the issues that may come up, particularly talking about the white elements in all of it, particularly talking about acceptable work, and that work may be holy but not acceptable. I think by the grace of God, the church has been blessed this morning. We thank God for our lecturer, able, capable, and, and worthy. And the second quarter of the year, the theme is one that is very much in the heart of the leadership. One, because of the importance of the new life in Christ and the fact that at the end of it all, the aim of every Christian is to live with Christ. That is why we want to encourage all of us that the 13 weeks or so in this quarter should be a time of great awakening for us so that God bless you for that. So that at the end of the day all of us will be part of that church Christ is coming up he is coming for without wrinkle or spot I pray that the good Lord will continue to be with us bless the church bless our lecturer and all the ministers God bless you God bless our church only for our prayer in for prayer
I want to intentional in this prayer. Number one prayer point is in the book of that Ecclesiastes 9, verse 8 that our garment will always be white and our head will never lack oil. As the name of Jesus once, will tell God my garment should not be stained. I should not be found on my head. I will give us two minutes. Oh, no, leave me a God of bear. And God, I guess what? Prayers in the name of Jesus. I want to answer. Oh, no, I saw a lamb, you a God of dirty. My garment must not be stained. I don't saw a lamb, you a God of dirty. My garment must not be stained. Oh, no, leave me a God of bear. I should not run child. Oh, no, I'm not going to be in with me. God help me. I saw a lamb, you a God of dirty. My garment. Oh no, he knew God of bear. I should not try. Oh my my sorrow, sorrow. Speak up. Oh no, I'm trying to be a God of dirty. My white garment should not be. Oh no, he knew God of bear. I should not try for my. Oh no, we must show him what that is all about. Hey, I'm not one. 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 You have one more minute. Talk to God. Talk to God. You can engage God. You can engage God. You can still engage God. You can press again. You can press. You can press in the spirit. You can press in the spirit. You can press in the spirit. Oluwa, I show a lamb your God of dirty. Oh no, give your God of bad. Let's press in the spirit. Sorrow, sorrow. I show a lamb your God of dirty. Oh no, give me your God of bad. Hey, oh me no one. Sorrow, oh no, hey, oh me no one. In Jesus' name we pray. I had this prayer point now in my spirit. When you conquer the move, you conquer the move face to face. Look for someone to hold and stand. God is about to do something important in our lives. Hold that person well. You call the name of Jesus. Oluwa. Lord. 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 Set up your fire of revival in our lives. Mo 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 hope for image of Agbadua. Oluwa. Etaina so Jesus no aye wa. I pray for Jesus Agbadua. Call the name of Jesus. Allah bala kore man la manza. Allah koli Allah na kede. Solo, speak. Allah, activate the life. Activate the life. Activate the life. You can talk. Allah, ke da ba ko ba ka da ba le akada. Something is happening in your spirit. Something is happening in your spirit. The fire of God is entering. The fire of God is coming in your room. There is a fire that is activated. There is a fire that is activated. There is a fire that is activated. A time is surging. Esolo, you have one more minute. A time is surging. He do your fire of revival. Oh, Solo, Dada. You are not speaking. Oh, well. Sarah, you are not praying well. Hey, Amen, Joe Sorrow. Both of you are not praying. Hey, Amen, Joe Sorrow. Both of you are not speaking. Hey, Amen, Joe Sorrow. Both of you are not speaking. Something I had the forces two by two. Allah Kopala Keda Basho Saliala. Something is happening in your spirits. There is a fire coming up. 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 By the fire coming up. In Jesus' name we pray. You call the name of Jesus. The new fire that has come up. 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 Destroy all 
Yala ke la manza la kiale Yala ke la asa la ke kadabala li musa Yala ke danko ala Eko ke ali ala ka kopalale Yala ke la ala komansa lele Ali ale la la baza Yale ale kade la kuma Ah, e yon ke li te wale eche 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 Ali ala ka kole la la Asa la ke Ino to sokale Ala kole la kada la la koba Ala ke le kada ba la koba le la Asa la You can press in the spirit more Ala ke la la ke kada le la Ah Ala le kabasa In Jesus name we pray I perceive in my spirit Ako pa le man sa le kada ma I perceive in my spirit Angel came with gifts Asalela ko pa le la la Alia la ke la la ma Zalia aka kulia alela akaka kiaka kumasa seleka kakade alale alala alako kadama piaka kadake pasa sala keliala ako pale aleke ke 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 masa aseke de kada kaka kumasa alia la ke dan kada kadaba alako ka edale alako ba asala ke kapala kopale ke ke la kadala kiala aseleka ke kiaka koa alako Pale ke asa se sa 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 asi anka pale ke monso kodi anka la kapa ka iya la ke la kara eta wale receive them there is a gift there is a dimension that came now ipele ebukawa to wa ni si eso pe a se oluwa the authority of God. The authority of God. The authority of God. The authority of God. The authority of The authority to succeed. Oh, yeah, Mokba. I will see this. Oh, God, that's what I do. I say, come on, everybody. Say, I will see this. Ashe aluyo, the authority to break through. Ashe aluyo mokba, authority to break through. Shakwe mokba, say I receive it. Shakwe mokba, say I receive it. Oku thirty seconds. Shakwe mokba, say I receive it. In Jesus, mighty name we pray. The Lord God Jesus Christ in our God. Bring out your evangelical offering. More to kala ejadi. Mu evangelical offering, Jadi. Bring out your evangelical offering. So pray, Baba. With joy in my heart. Pelu ayo ni no akomi. I bring it. Mumu wa. Please accept it. So tell Baba. Pray in the name of Jesus Christ. So the adu ani we call Jesus. Father, with joy in my heart, we receive it. Father, please accept it, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. I declare by this offering, doors are opening for you. Amen. The anointing that preserve you for your generation fall upon you afresh now in Jesus' name. Amen. You will not be corrupted. Amen. You will not be perverse. Amen. Go and excel. Amen. This week shall bring testimonies. Amen. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray.
silent prayers. Let's give thanks to God for the grace of Christ Jesus and the grace of the resurrection in him. Let us pray for the inspiration of the power of God and the grace to progress in him. Let us commit this week into the hands of God. We should pray for ourselves and the church of God and everything that is ours. Let us remember to dedicate our lives to God that He should use it for His glory and he should make us reside in heavenly joy he should take us away from all annihilators so we can have fullness of joy in him what we But our resurrection life, a resurrected life, resurrected life. But our for Christ Jesus. Clap for Jesus Christ. Once again, we want to appreciate every one of us that has participated in this service. We know the grace of God shall continue to abound in our life. We want to remind us that we shall be having another wonderful service next week. But, but in that service, in that service, um, the Lydia and Samuel and um, the Emmanuel Bass we will be celebrating their anniversary and uh, we are the parents of these uh, kids and uh, because of uh, the resurrection res life life of obedience life of sacrifice and as usual we shall be vacating this hall for them and we shall hold that service at uh, Oyelola Oye Oye Hall 
As usual, we should come early. As our, our, our teacher has told us today, for a resurrected life, we must be obedient. We must come early to church. We must wait for the cross to go before we go out. We thank God not for the mail today. They are not. They are not going out. Let's give them a round of applause. You can see they are not going out. They are seated. They are waiting for the cross to go down. God bless the church. So as we continue to live a resurrected life, continue to live a life of obedience and sacrifice, God will continue to bless us. And we shall be going from glory to glory, from honor to honor, from joy to joy. God bless you as you go this week. Jesus, where is it? 
I'm walking, I'm walking in power. Hey, I'm, I live in love. Lui. 